welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to this world. Where it's not just my world, but it's your world. For the most part, it's God's world, so stay blessed and don't be stressed. So I'm drinking my good old tea. And nice and well hot to see the steam. So just for anybody who wants to know what it tastes like, the tea that I made on the channel yesterday, video yesterday, um, it is a little bitter. Um, if you don't like the bitterness or like I don't put sugar I put like maybe a teaspoon of honey but um if you're a sugar person you're not really gonna get anything else so I'm trying to get off on this not the no sugar but leading it towards not drinking much sugar or eating much sugar so it is a little bit bitter however if you was to make straight ro rosemary tea without nothing it would be way more bitter Okay, so let's just get that clarified. So if you're new here, welcome to my channel. It's Vlogtober day two. So I'm probably gonna pre-record some stuff in the later month of October, but for now, you guys are gonna get probably the day after. So the vlog for the first is probably gonna come on the second, so the vlog for the second is gonna come on the third until I figure out a way to catch up. <laughs> So today, um, Alex volunteered me to cook, but we're gonna cook, cook um, together. So y'all gonna see a little snippet of that. Um, and I'm probably gonna make a cake. Ew. Yeah, I'm gonna make a cake. I'm not gonna make a whole video of it, but I am gonna show you guys because I'm gonna make it from a box. So maybe in the month, I'll probably make it again. Y'all yeah, have me, I'm gonna be a whole house. I'm gonna be making pastries. Or not. I don't know. What did I decide? But, um, yeah, we're heading to Food Depot to pick up the stuff for the food. I think we're making barbecue chicken. And I don't know what else. So, like, comment, subscribe, and share. Happy October number two. Day two. Yeah. Look at Daddy. You see, Gabriel? Yeah, put him in here. Okay guys, so Alex left me. Um, the mayor left me. They went to go get a haircut. So I'm left at the house with the items to cook. So I forgot to, to send, show you guys exactly what I cooked. I mean, what I bought at the store, but pretty much I'll just show you guys. I bought thyme, I bought coconut milk, I bought scallion, tomato, cucumber, some avocados, um, some peas to make rice and peas. Um, I made some, I'm in the process of making um, this. So I'm not making it from scratch. I'm going to, I wanna learn, like I said, I'm gonna join and learn. So I know it's probably, it only takes like a couple of ingredients, but I haven't mastered it yet, obviously, so I'm gonna always use it out the box. So I already mixed everything up. So you just read the directions of what you need. Three, what is it? One cup of water, three eggs, and a half a cup of oil. That is exactly what I did. Mix it all up. But the twist to it is I'm going to um, spice it up with um, some pineapple rings. So I'm gonna make like a syrup and then I'm gonna put it on it with the pineapple rings so it can taste a little bit more, you know, special. And I did buy the Jiffy Mix for the peach um, cornbread. So I'm gonna make that another day. That's gonna be a vlog. Very short, but yeah. And then I got peas for ribeye and peas that I was gonna make. I got barbecue sauce, um, you know, the whole sweet baby rays, bar barbecue sauce, I got that. And I'll show you guys the pineapples. It's the pineapples that I got. And a little bit of oil. And that's about it. So I seasoned up the food, so I'll show you guys that in a second. The mirror, Gabriel and I are here by ourselves. Um, I'm gonna make the pineapple upside down cake in a blunt pan, some different, but that's about it. So I'm gonna show you guys step by step. I do not have my stand. Oh, I left my stand, so I have to like do this with my phone. Yeah. So this is what the cake mix looks like. I put all the ingredients in it. This is what it looks like. Pretty self-explanatory, yeah. 
So when I put in the pan with the pineapples and I make the syrup, which is just gonna be sugar and water and a little bit of um, cinnamon, I'll get back to you guys. Okay, so I put the juice that was in the can of the pineapple rings, I put about the same amount of water, brown sugar, about two tablespoons, two and a half tablespoons of brown sugar, um, some vanilla extract, and some cinnamon. I'm gonna let this come to a boil, and yeah. In the meantime, in between time, I'm going to put the chicken in the oven because Alice is gonna cook it, but I'm just gonna start because it's after, almost three o'clock and he's still getting a haircut, so I'll just help him out a little bit, not a big deal. Although I didn't wanna cook, but it's okay, because <laughs> we gotta eat anyway. So um, yes, I'm gonna put this in the oven, 400 degrees, yeah. So he's gonna be barbecue chicken. I'll make the sauce in a second. This is what the pineapple rings look like. I just took it out the can, so I'm just gonna cover it till I'm ready for the cake. Okay, so I decided to be a nice, sweet fiance and start the rice and eat. <laughs> so I think this is like a cup and a half of peas to about, ooh, I think it's like four cups of water and two cloves of garlic just to boil the peas so we didn't get a chance to soak it overnight no so we're just gonna boil it so let's just say i got the peas in the pot at the bottom and the water is about an inch above the peas let's put it like that okay for measurement it's about a inch my finger yeah so it's it's about right yeah inch some of that yeah so once your syrup is like caramelized we're gonna put it in the bun pan so i did line my bun pan with the pineapples yes. and gabriel ate the rest so what i'm gonna do now is i'm gonna let this cool for a little bit <laughs> The syrup, I'm gonna cool for a little bit and I'm gonna pour it in here. Not for long, maybe like five minutes. And I'm just pouring it in here. Pour it on here. I didn't put a lot because obviously. I didn't put a lot because I don't want a lot, so I just put a little bit. And then I'm gonna put the batter on top of it. See, pineapple upside down, okay? Yeah. So that's what it looks like. So I'm putting it in the oven for about 25 minutes. It's at 400. If it was at 350, it would be 30 minutes, but I just cut the time down a little bit. That's all. But the chicken's so cold. Tomato and cucumber. Get Gabriel love cucumber, guys. <laughs> Him love cucumber. <laughs> He's vacuuming the house. Yes, guys. So Alex is still on the road. He had to go do some stuff. He got a haircut. And then other stuff he had to do. So I said, you know what? I don't mind. Like I'm here. I'll just cook the food. You guys, we have to eat anyway. So I cook everything. <laughs> Thank you, honey. <laughs> he cooked, I cooked everything, so there's rice and peas, veggies, barbecue chicken, and a cake. Nothing fussy, it's Sunday, you know, it's what it is. 
Sweet the chin. Sam, what are you doing? How was dinner? Mm. Alex said I did a good job on the rice and peas. <laughs> People, I was praying <laughs> that the rice and peas come out good. So I feel more confident now. So usually in my other videos, I don't make it from scratch. I'll make it with like 10 peas. And I'll just try my best to judge it. Some days it did come out soft. Sometimes it came out soft. But this time, it came out really good. So, practice, you know, practice makes progress. So, at the end of the day, I feel comfortable that next time I make it, I will, I will video it. Because I was going to have Alex make it. <laughs> but now I feel more confident I'm going to make it myself. So let me know how y'all think the dinner came out. Alex said it was great. Alex's mom said it came out really good. So that means a lot because her rice and peas is very good. So for her to judge me, that's just a good, good, good thing. <laughs> so we're heading to um, Pelican Snow Snowball. Oh, so because I cooked and Alex was at the, at the barbershop, like I think I told you guys. He got me a bottle of wine. Oh, this is the this is sweetest little thing. Hey, this is the sweetest little thing. Yeah, he got me a bottle of wine. So for the kids, um, we're gonna get them some snow cone, and um, then we're gonna go home. So the wine is called it's the Snoop Dogg wine that a lot of ladies tell me that they like it, and I've heard about it. So I said, let me try it. So in the comment section, let me know if you guys have tried it before and if you like it. By the time you guys comment, I've probably already drinking it or I've already had a glass. So yeah, so it was a good day, pretty chill. I'm gonna try my best to upload this later on tonight so that I'm not that much behind. So yeah, after the Pelican Snowball, I think that's it for the night. All right guys, yeah. have the sizes kitty regular large and avalanche then you pick your flavor pick your topping okay prices four dollars for the small and regular large avalanche stuff then in the water then this is the flavors that they have yeah zombie more they have a bunch of flavors no high pork no high fructose corn syrup, sugar free flavors available. Yeah, nice little place. And this is where you order, and this is where you pick up. So that's good. So they have toppings. You can pick, okay, Ma marshmallow, cream, condensed milk, all kind of stuff. And I guess these are like examples, special signatures. Yeah. So we got this for Gabriel. We got this for Demir. And then I got a uh, guava. Did I say guava and pineapple? Which one did I say, babe? I don't remember, you know. I think it was, I think it was guava and, no, guava and mango. And mine's was stuffed. So the stuff is like, um, Rita's. If you go to Rita's, you know that you usually get like the, the custard on top of the, of the icy. So that's what I got. So it has the icy, then ice cream, then icy on the top. So that's what I got. Um, I think that Alex got um, the regular one, and we all got regulars, so they're all five dollars. Like for the kids, it's four dollars, cause we don't that need that much sweet. And I think Alex got um, what did he get? 
um, strawberry shortcake. And then I think his brother, we got some for his brother and his mom. They only got mango. Yeah, so that's it. So if the video is done here, don't forget to play, be patient, persevere, yeah. and then surely progress, all right? Have a good night, have a good day, have a happy Sunday. Bye!